welcome. I'm Lynn of Lynn X Stitches Creates, and this is a special floss tube video unboxing for the very first Black Needle Society box of 2022. It is the Happy Hour Stitching Box, and I have been looking forward to this one. Erin um, Martini Stitcher, she helped curate this box, so I know it's going to be an amazing one. Um, my mail, of course, was late today. Mailman must know <laughs> when there's a box I'm going to be waiting. I don't know. Had a little bit of a rough journey, I think. Um, this is the first box that I am receiving as an official rep. Um, the other boxes that I have shown up until this point, I have paid for. The next um, three subscription boxes will be because I am a rep for the Black Needle Society. Um, that doesn't mean I get anything different than you guys. Um, just means they're, they're giving me this box to help promote their business. And I do it anyway, because I love their boxes. So I have only cut the tape. So here we go. Okay, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, it is so packed. Okay, so here is the challenge card that comes with it. Um, every subscription box, they're, they are bi-monthly, um, comes with the program card and telling about the items. Note from the Black Needle Society, um, Laura, Katie, and Athena. The next box that has gone on sale um, is the May box, which is mermaids, unicorns, and dragons. Oh my, you know my little geeky heart is so happy. Um, and on the back is the photo challenge. And oh my gosh, one of my pictures made it from the resolution box. I'm so excited. I thought that one was, I thought that one did come out good too. So thank you, Laura, Katie, and Athena. I've, I'm thankful that you picked my picture. That's exciting. <laughs> okay, so I don't have my glasses on. So let's just start. We all know what this package is. This is our needle minder. Um, and it says exclusive needle minder on it. You can rip it if you want, but you can also just pull it apart. It's just as easy. So our needle minder, and it says, it's got two martini glasses, and it says, always happy hour. I don't know if it's blurry because I don't have my glasses on. <laughs> so I'm sorry if it was in focus. That's cute though. Um, ooh, pretty floss. Okay. Oh, okay. So in the niceless box in, at Christmas time, we got a bag from um, Live and Die LA. And now we have some floss from them. Isn't that pretty? Okay, so we have Melon Illusion. We have Tequila Sunrise. Isn't that pretty? And we have a Bordeaux. Very pretty burgundy. Very, very nice. Oh, I guess I should read you from the card too if I can. Okay, so the Needle Minder, designed by the Black Needle Society. Who needs to wait for happy hour? It's always happy hour when stitching is involved. And then the Specialty Floss, Made by Live and Die LA, this cocktail-inspired trio was created exclusively for our January box customers. So those are very pretty and very soft. Can't wait to use those. Okay, um, I'm going to go for the big box. And, ooh, ooh, isn't that pretty? Cheers. 
and it's it's like a gold it's gold foil let's see uh, exclusive cheers wine glass designed by the black needle society we are inspired by aaron's floss tube closing line cheers to create this wine glass for your next happy hour isn't that pretty it's a nice size So far, I've picked the first three items that are listed. Um, let's try the other box. And then I've got the fourth one that's in right in a row. Okay, so this is tart raspberry syrup. All natural. Um, the raspberry simple syrup made by shaker and spoon. Erin regularly subscribes to and enjoys Shaker and Spoon subscription boxes. She asked if it would be possible for us to partner with them to bring you a simple syrup from their collection. We are happy to include their tart raspberry simple syrup, which you can use to make a... I need my glasses for this one. Framboy Boz cocktail recipe is on their YouTube channel. Yeah, Framboy Thaws. Or experiment with your own creations. They recommend you use with gin, but will hold up in any alcohol you choose. I don't think I have any gin. Vodka and rum, yes, but no gin. So we'll have to we may make a trip to the liquor store. There's also a recipe on the back here. I don't know if that's the same... Yeah. Yeah, the recipe is on here too. Spiced apple cider, gin, the raspberry syrup, and heavy cream and cinnamon. Oh, that's interesting. Hmm. That should be interesting. Okay. Then we've got. Oh. Sorry, everybody. There we go. We've got, it's stitch o'clock somewhere. It's always stitch o'clock. Cute tote bag, look at that. And it's got beautiful purple lining. Oh my gosh, that's so pretty. Look at that. I love it. Um, exclusive stitch o'clock tote bag designed by Blanca Design. Meeting up with friends for a sip and stitch Travel safely with this vinyl tote bag, which conveniently is large enough to tuck a bottle of wine into as well. So there you go. That's pretty. Um, okay. Okay. Snacking and crafting finger chopsticks. This has been a conversation on different um, Zooms. What do you snack? How do you eat it? You know, people that have Cheetos while they're they're stitching and stuff, how do they keep their things clean? So there you go. Um, crafted by the Black Needle, curated, sorry, by the Black Needle Society. You can't have a happy hour without snacks but no one wants a food stained project. Use these chopsticks so you can keep stitching while snacking with no mess. <laughs> That's pretty funny. <sighs> okay. Um, ooh. Uh, okay. So these are counting pins exclusive martini garnish counting pin set designed by the black needle society did someone say martini would you like that with an olive an onion or a twist use these pins to keep your counting straight just in case you have a little too much fun at happy hour also a cute addition to a soft fully finished project those are pretty
got our exclusive five o'clock fabric made by Seraphim Fabrics. This is um, called five o'clock somewhere and it's 32 count. So it's kind of not an olive green, maybe a lime green. It's pretty. Um, Aaron asked Lori of Seraph at Seraphim Fabrics to create a green olive inspired fabric for this special box. It is not the called for fabric for our pattern of the month, but we think it may be a great option with approximately two inch margins. I think that's a pretty color though. I could see doing something Easter on that. And then our pattern is from Ink Circles and it's called Five O'Clock. So the Five O'Clock Somewhere Cross Stitch Pattern designed by Ink Circles. We are thrilled to include another custom pattern in our subscription boxes from Tracy over at Ink Circles. Erin specifically chose Tracy to create her dream happy hour patterns for this box and we are def and we definitely agree she was the perfect choice. Grab a cocktail and enjoy the stitch. That's fun. I have I there's a lot of ink circles patterns I like and I have not yet stitched one. I've got the one that Candy gave me, um, the 614 stitcher gave me for Christmas. That's tea and now I have an alcohol inspired one. That is really cute. I like it. So another great box by the Black Needle Society. And I, I think you could definitely do that on this. Um, this was done on Weeks Dye Works Dove, but I still think you could use this. Such gorgeous fabric and floss, such fun things. Um, great box. I enjoyed it. Um, so, the my code, as you may know, is LIN5 uh, for any purchase that you make in the vault of the Black Needle Society. When you're checking out, put in LIN5, you'll get 5% off uh, your purchase. And the next box that we will receive that we've already paid for is the March box, which is Steampunk. And Ashley will join me for that one because she got one, was able to snag one too. Um, and then of course, they are taking orders for the May box, the mermaids, unicorns, and dragons, oh my, which will also be a lot of fun. Um, ooh, and it says for that one, our hint, our there's a hint, our designer is a returning customer favorite. So, great box, happy hour box. I will be looking on Instagram for your pictures that you put up for the photo challenge. Um, if you got this box, if not, I hope you'll enjoy all the photographs that people will put up of their box. And until my next floss tube, which will be filmed in just a little while. Ashley's got to get off work. So until then, happy stitching and I'll see you later. Bye.